hi YouTubers, it's Smokey77 again. Um, I just had a Cohiba, Habano, Cuban, Cuba, Maduro number 5. Um, this is one of the cigars that um, Beans sent me a while back. Thank you very much, Beans. I love trying new things, and especially Cuban cigars. Uh, let me just say this cigar was not too, that good. Um, the cigar is about, it's a small cigar, um, probably about four inches long, maybe three and a half inches. Very small ring gauge. I cut it. I lit it up. The first thing I noticed was it had a very snug draw. If any of you know what a snug draw is, then you'll know what I mean. Um, very hard to puff on. Um, and the entire stick was very, very, very hard to puff on. It lasted for about 40, 45 minutes. It actually produced uh, produced uh, quite a bit of strength from the cigar in terms of nicotine. This may be one of those cigars I've been hearing that from other people, uh, including Brian Glenn from CigarObsession.com, that um, Cuban cigars are not being produced the way they uh, used to be 10, 15, 20 years ago, and they're getting less and less experience for rollers for these Cuban cigars, and uh, as a result, there's more knots in Cuban cigars, resulting in tighter draws. So that could be it, or it could also be that this is one of the cigars that is meant to be um, that is meant to just for meant for the strength, not the taste. I mean, there are people who smoke cigars who really, really, really like that um, that nicotine or ammonia buzz from the cigar. So if you're into that uh, nicotine ammonia buzz, which I'm not, uh, then this may be a very good cigar for you. Because it did produce quite a bit, not a huge amount of strength, but it did produce a little bit of lightheaded feeling and a little bit of a dizzy feeling from it. So, uh, this could be another one of the cigars that he's meant for the strength. Um, the taste I get of it, the flavors, which really counts, um, are a pine, um, a earth, a nice tobacco taste, and a nice aged tobacco taste. This is aged five years. And also a very nice um earth tobacco taste. Um oh I lost my train of thought. Um Oh my god, I can't believe I lost my track of thought. Um but you get the point. I mean it's just a earth, a a pepper that yes, that's what it was was a pepper. A very, you get a, very, a lot of pepper from this cigar. So, earth, pepper taste, tobacco taste, and a little bit of, um, I don't know. But, um, overall, not a very good cigar. Very tight draw, very hard to puff, puff on. Uh, not that good. So, probably 6 out of 10 for rating. Not good at all. But, um, I mean, it's, it's smokable. It's definitely not, I've had worse cigars. I mean, it's, it lasts longer than, like, White Owl. Um, it's smokable. Um, that's why it's going to get a 6 out of 10 versus, like, a 3 out of 10. But it's, it's a very, very, very tight draw. So be warned. So it could be just a cigar. Who knows? Peace out. Bye.